without putting on a uniform Smart when nuts and rode a unicorn through the storm Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again, bringing you guys another Madden 16 Draft Champions video. And guys, what you're watching here is actually the end of one of the games that I played in between no game number two and game number four. So obviously this is game number three. Final score of it was 50 to seven. The reason that you're not gonna be watching it is because it was probably the laggiest game of Madden that I have ever played. It was so terrible. You see me there making some nice moves and stuff, that's fine, but like in the actual gameplay, it was absolutely ridiculous. That was like the one play that he got, by the way, that ended up him with him getting a touchdown. He just chucked it up deep and Irvin made a crazy catch on it, but whatever. You know, the point that I'm trying to make here is I wanted this game to end a lot quicker than it did, but this guy played out the entire thing despite it just being terribly laggy and the score being obviously completely out of control by the end of it. So I don't know, it was frustrating. But what we're going to do here, guys, is hop into game number four, my championship game of my Draft Champions series here. I'm really loving this team. I am having so much fun with it. And right away, guys, we're taking off for a huge game with Emmett Smith there off the side. 37 yards on the quick toss. Emmett getting things started very early in this game. Now, second and 10, we're going to the fullback here in the flats, and he is going to make a nice spin move. Mitt trying to make another move there before we get tackled out of bounds. Brings up now a second and, and nine here, and we find our man going over the middle there. I believe that was Campanero out of the slot making a nice grab. So we do get into the end zone there. Seven to nothing on the first drive of the game. Looking very, very good early in this one. Scoring on every first drive that we had, I think, in this whole draft champion series. So that's always a good sign. Now my opponent's got the ball on offense and he is bombing it deep. That is Jordan Matthews. Crazy, crazy grab. Guys, that was Denard Robinson throwing the ball that far down the field that accurately. Just goes to show you that, in my opinion, deep throw accuracy is highly overrated in this game. It just seems like everybody throws it accurately. Like, I don't know. There are just some times where nobody throws it accurately, and then other times where everybody throws it accurately. Nice little throw by him there in the flat to his tight end. Chase Ford gets into the end zone. Hey, I've been using my own Chase Ford as well, so I know how to use him. But... Ensuing kickoff. We've got some return room here. Brandon Cooks taking it out to midfield there, the 50-yard line. And now we're in shape here to get some yardage here on offense. Trying to continue running the ball off the edge there with Emmett Smith. As long as we establish the run, whether it be up, up the middle runs or outside runs, we're typically going to do pretty well with our passing game as well. Because I get these guys really committed on the run. Really, well, really committed on stopping the run, I should say. And then we're able to do stuff like this. Chase Ford. Our chase forward this time with a nice grab there, tiptoeing on the sidelines before he does go out of bounds. And then the next play, we're able to get into the end zone there with the quick toss. Emmett Smith, yet another touchdown here in this draft champion series. So beautiful, beautiful job there for us on offense. Now it's time to make a stop on defense. We have to be able to stop this guy. Even if we score on every drive, as long as he keeps scoring, we're going to be in trouble. So it's definitely something where we need to make the plays here on deep balls like this. Unfortunately, our guy did not make the grab there that was an overthrow by Robinson for sure but the next play take a look at that third and seven just a dot by Denard Robinson crazy crazy stuff and now we're gonna bring some heat on him nice little play there I think that was just actually just a nice block shed there by Nick Fairley so gotta love that brings up a second and 19 he hits the nice little celebration there as well so looking pretty good my opponent trying to go over the middle again there I think with his four verts play but again we're bringing some heat on him third and 19 here basically what I'm trying to do is just prevent the deep ball that's all that we really have to do here in my opinion but look how much time my opponent has to throw this football finally we're going to try and take off here and unfortunately our guys just can't keep the coverage so he does complete another deep throw in traffic with Denard Robinson crazy crazy stuff but man he's doing a great job we're keeping now a QB spy on him we do not want Denard Robinson taken off but again he's got all the time in the world Nick Fairley finally gets to him forces an incompletion brings up now a second and 10 and again we've got another QB spy on him I didn't really think about that I should be sending this guy to go after him 
but again I didn't really want him to take off and run either and like juke out my guy so that's what we're trying to stop and right there absolutely ridiculous man like this guy is just throwing dots with Denard Robinson 30 40 yards down the field like I've never seen anything more ridiculous than that I think he's had one overthrow so far and he's going deep almost every single play so it's a tie game now I've got about 50 seconds left here in the first half trying to put up some points before the end of the first half because I believe my opponent gets the ball first so we do want to try and put up at least a field goal so we're trying to run the ball here now on first and 10 which I know isn't really the best idea and that really didn't turn out that good for me but I do want to still show him that I'm willing to run so that was basically what that was for we find a receiver here but unfortunately our quarterback Mark Sanchez who's actually a quarterback granted he sucks but don't get me wrong he's at least a quarterback completely underthrows it for some reason so we do end up having to punt after taking a sack there on third down now my opponent's got a little bit of time here left in the first half but fortunately we're just going to be able to stop him uh he does take off and pick up a first down so that pads his stats a little bit but he doesn't get any points before the end of the first half he does get the ball to start the second half though and he's scored every single drive that he has had the ball so we definitely need to make a stop here and really turn things around in this game second and one here and he is going to look deep again look at this another deep completion he's completed 9 of 12 passes for 196 yards like I would expect this out of like a Tom Brady or something like that in Madden Ultimate Team where you can just throw up aggressive catches he's not doing that he's finding space making crazy crazy throws and it's just working out for him I have no words see this is the kind of stuff that I would expect out of Denard Robinson short dink and dunk type of passes I have no problem with that completely realistic right Denard Robinson can make those types of throws he cannot throw the ball 40 yards down the field into complete into coverage and make completions it's just not going to happen in real life fortunately we make a stop there on third and three so it brings up a fourth and three and surprisingly he actually decided not to go for it so I felt pretty good about that but unfortunately he has so much pressure getting to us Beerman again off the edge it's just looking like he's getting completely no like he's not even getting touched practically I have no words Thankfully there on second and 17, Ford goes up and makes a beautiful grab there, an aggressive catch. Hey, I get to get bailed out on occasion too, man. It, it's going to happen from time to time. We go back to the toss there though on first down, picking up nice yardage. And now we're going to try and attack in here, going up the middle here with Emmett Smith, abusing his defensive line, which isn't really that good. He's pretty much usering it. And again, Sanchez overthrows a wide open receiver. God forbid our quarterback just makes a decent throw even. We're not expecting like amazing dots. I just want something decent. Thankfully, there we do pick up a first down there. Christian Michael, the silver bala in draft champions. And again, Sanchez overthrowing yet another wide open receiver. Oh my goodness, man. So frustrating. Thankfully, he does make a nice completion there. We try and dive into the end zone with Ford. He doesn't quite get there, but it's okay. A couple plays later, Sanchez is going to get into the end zone with the QB sneak. So, we do take the lead back here. 21-17. to Got to make a stop here, though, and I know he wants to go deep. And again, he's going to get another receiver wide open. 13 completions, 260 yards. Guys, he's averaging 20 yards per completion insane like oh my freaking god with denard robinson i like i have no words so unfortunately we're giving up some short stuff now because i'm just trying to drop guys back to try and stop the deep ball at this point and again he's gonna throw it up here into coverage deep but he does make the completion again it's just unbelievable that gets reviewed it was called incomplete on the field does get overturned uh so unfortunately man like i i just I don't know what to do at this point. We can't stop this guy's passing game. Denard Robinson is just too good, apparently. So, uh, yeah. First down, though, we do get stopped there. We do have some time here to put points on the board. Dangerous, dangerous throw there by Sanchez. A minute 32. This is the game, basically. We have to make a play here. We've got a receiver open, but we throw the pick. No. Oh, my God. Why? You've got to be kidding me. I am just absolutely distraught at this point. Never give up. Trust your instincts. We fought so hard only to have this happen. First and 10 here. We commit on the run, and he is going to throw it into coverage. We make the interception. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Ball back in our hands now. A minute 19 on the clock. We've got to make some plays here. We've got all three of our timeouts, though. So this is the final drive of the football game. 
Nice throw there by Sanchez. Can't hold on to it, though. 9 of 17 throwing with Sanchez. So many missed throws in this game. Denard Robinson making every pass possible. Sanchez, an actual quarterback, not making any throws, unfortunately. But we've got to make something happen here on the final drive of the game. Sanchez looking down the field, and we're going to throw this one away with him using his defensive tackle, getting pressure on us there. We find a receiver, and it's another dropped pass bringing up now a third and 10. We've still got time here. Finding a man over the middle there is Jim Dre making the grab in traffic, getting past him, picking up the first down. And now we're gonna go back to the tight end again here. Jim Dre again on the PA Scissors route. 30 seconds left on the clock. And guys, we're looking deep. Oh my gosh, we nearly get sacked there. He sent the freaking house there on first down. Thankfully, we're able to get the throw off. And guys, with 30 seconds left in two timeouts, we make the run. Emmett Smith off the edge, and he is into the end zone for the lead. Let's go, baby. Emmett Smith coming up in the clutch. The blocking was there. Absolutely huge. There is still time left on the clock, though. 10 seconds left, he's going deep, he's been successful all game and we nearly intercept that one. Six seconds left on the clock and my opponent's going to pause and ladies and gentlemen, he is going to rage quit as well. My goodness, what a finish. Crazy, crazy finish of this game, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this one. We do walk away with the Draft Champions Championship in this series. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a favor. Click that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'll talk to you guys again soon. Hey guys, if you're enjoying my videos, do me a favor. Click that subscribe button on the right side of your screen right now. Otherwise, you can always check out my previous video by clicking on the left side of the screen. Thank you guys again.